what's cracking? It's Black T, and I am rocking a screwdriver. That's right. Not the alcoholic drink, the actual thing. What the heck? That looks, it's a weird animation. Anyways, I cleaned up this room a bit, made it look all sexy time. I hid the timer and stuff in the downstairs area. Except for that one, I couldn't figure out how to hide that timer and still keep it working. But anyways, just wanted to show you that. I made it look all good and, and stuff. So today we are going to make a piston door. And I have never made a piston door before. So it might be a little bit of an experiment. Um, I'm going to grab some of that, some of that. I need to make some pistons. So that's kind of the first thing on my agenda. I collected a little bit of wood and I also made a little path out here. So I was talking about that a while ago. You can kind of see it through there. Yeah. Just in case when I when I needed to run over to my other base. Um, I also need cobble, don't I? It's over here. Oh, my house smells terrible right now. I went to put some tea on or some hot water on. And I turned on the the burner where my pot was and my teapot not weed pot. Anyways, I turned on the burner where my, my teapot was and uh left, kind of went to the other room, waited for it to heat up, and then all of a sudden I just smelled something kind of burning, I was like, what the heck is that? So I went and looked, and I accidentally turned on a, um, turned on one of the burners that was not my teapot, it was like, I made some hamburgers, and, and that's what, uh, I turned on, so the the uh, grease and stuff from the hamburgers was just pretty much burning and ended up like just smoking up my whole kitchen. It was pretty disgusting. So now the house smells like that. But hey, figured that out. I got my teapot on the right on the right spot and now I got some tea. And it's delicious. And I only have one slime ball. I think my other slime balls are in the other area. I'm going to hop through this portal. Wham! Boom. Oh, hey, what's up, Enderman? Enderman! Alright, yeah, you just you just keep on moving. This is uh, part of the walkway that I built. Nice. All these monsters. So I'm going to go up here and get my slime balls, because I'm, sure, I'm pretty sure I got slime balls in... Oh, 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 oh this just in don't smack your mouse because that happens all right let me head on up here and see pretty sure we do my parts oh yeah boy nice all right heading on over uh yeah there we go so i've, I've been getting a few comments about people um kind of asking things about vanilla Minecraft or saying, go back to vanilla, oh no. Um, you know, I, I love vanilla Minecraft. I think it's fantastic. It's great. Um, but I also do love the mods that, that people in the community have made, and I think it adds some dimension to the actual, um, a, a bit more dimension to the actual game. I mean, both both games are fun and I definitely think it is for the most part a different game when you're playing with mods it it changes a lot of the things that that happen a lot of the things that you can do but um, that's one of the things that I love about Minecraft um, that that Notch made it very configurable and people can change it and he wants people to do that for the most part if he didn't then there's no way you know he would he would endorse mods but he does so um 
yeah, and I, I just think they're a lot of fun. It also it gives me a chance to get more resources quickly and more types of resources as well, but that allows me to do larger builds, and uh, I'm planning on doing a few different larger builds here to make some cool, cool stuff. And these mods are making that possible. So, all right, so we're going to make a piston door. Um, we're going to make a thing called a Jeb door, and it was popularized by Jeb, the guy who does Minecraft. Uh, shoot, I wish I had some smooth stone. I'll get some smooth stone later. Um, but Jeb is pretty much the guy who is working on Minecraft right now. He's the head developer for it. And uh, he put out a video for 1.7, I believe it was. I think it was 1.7, where they had pistons. And he showed this really cool setup that it was basically a door that extended and um, as the door extended it pretty much made it flush with the wall so uh, that I explained that terrible but <clears throat> you'll see what I'm doing as I do it so basically it takes these blocks here it pushes them over and it pushes them out so then this will be covered up which I think I actually I'm just gonna do two because I not exactly sure how to do the third so I'm gonna do two but basically this whole wall is just gonna look flush it's not gonna look like there's anything there I'm probably even gonna put in maybe I'll put in like a a bookcase or something so it looks kinda cool um, so it looks like the bookcase is just moving out of the way alright so I need to wire this to make it do what it needs to do and for that to happen, I need to clear out some of the space back here. I practiced this once or twice in in my test world, which let's just go ahead and make sure here. Let's check. Yep, it was on hard. Okay, just making sure. All right. Um, I think we need to go up maybe two more. So I made a few of these in my test world, but it's still going to be kind of interesting figuring this out because in each each time I could never make it work perfectly the first time around. There were some snags and and hookups, and it's funny because just to make this one thing, it takes up so much space, and even with the mods that I have installed, it still takes quite a bit of space. Ah, I forgot we needed to make some stuff. I, we need to make a repeater now there are two different types of repeaters there's a redstone or red power repeater and then the regular repeater oh, holy crap that's like ridiculous I think I'm just gonna make this the redstone repeater I don't really need this and I believe they do pretty much the exact same thing and this is just a better recipe so I'm going to actually go make some of those. Which way do I go? This way. Aha. All right, I'm going to shoot up these stairs and get the supplies I need. So, I've been... I don't listen to the radio a ton. I use Spotify a lot. And, which, Spotify is freaking sweet. It's basically like an iTunes, but you have access to every type of music every album that comes out you have access to it I'm not exactly sure how it's super legal I mean it is legal it's not like a a torrent or something that you download um, but you basically sign up and you can listen to whatever music you want for free and a redstone in the middle yeah but it's super cool, and I've been just kind of listening to a lot of different random stuff. And uh, some of my favorite people have been um, just one band called The Tallest Man on Earth, which it's just basically a guy. And then um, 
Common, who's a rapper. He He's just awesome. But those are some things that I've been listening to. What are some things that you guys have been listening to? I'm always on the lookout for new music and, and better music. I think I just need those repeaters. I don't know that I need anything else currently. Well, actually, actually I do. I, I'm going to make, and I think this is the correct... Awesome. Okay, a wireless receiver, right? Okay, cool. And then I need to make a RS latch. Or no, a toggle latch. Okay, that's what I need to make. This toggle latch is basically like that ginormous thing that I used and still have in my... Um, in my zombie farm but it's a much 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 more compact thing so I need a lever to the stone cathodes alright so let's let's make that happen here I need where are my wafers wafers what else do I got in here let's take these redstone torches might as well I got so much stuff in here alright I need to make okay I got a lever so I need to make that cathode right if, is it like this is it like that it's like that stone cathode okay I need two of those right boom there we go cool Let's see toggle latch Okay, I need two wafers with this, so one, two, one, two, and four, do I have four, yes I do, okay, so one, two, three, four, one, two, one, two, and a latch, All right, lever, awesome, so I have a toggle latch. I have my redstone repeater. Let me shut this off. Um, my redstone, I got some stone in here. I got a torch, which I don't really need the torch, but whatever. Alright, so I'm going to head back down this way. I need to clean up these stairways and maybe even make a quicker way to get to my equivalent exchange room. Which is the thing that I'm working on right now. If you didn't, if you did not know, it's my oh look at that! It's equivalent exchange. Except there's not really much going on here. There's a bunch of Mobius fuel in there, which is sweet. But oh, there's some awesome diamonds. I could dig that, but they're going slow, and I think we can speed that up a lot. Till then, I'm gonna do this. Hurry it up. Hurry it up. Anyways, let's get this Jeb door working. Okay. No. Let's maybe go one more out. I don't know that we can go more than that. Maybe we can. I'm not sure how far from the outside we are. Alright, I think I need to go like... Um... Here... Y'all, it's funny. I watch Brenny. Brenny Beast is his YouTube name, and he—I think he's from Australia. And uh, he's just like y'all. He always says that all the time. It's, it's hilarious. Okay, let me see. I'm just gonna do this. This might not work. We're going to see here in a few seconds. Oh, yeah. Alright, where's my torch? I uh, will just use this lever. Sweet, it works. Okay, so it pushes this out. Pew. Which is cool. And from the outside, it looks like this. There. So, I mean, that's close, but now I need to get these pistons to extend out. So I'm going to go back in here. Here. 
and throw down some stone right here right here okay take this out of here and basically yeah we're gonna take and run this up here and hopefully let's see go like that now, this might not work because this might power this block and push that one out too fast okay yeah I think it won't so I'm gonna run this up the wall here so it's not powering this and then bring it over um, okay let's see and then the pistons are gonna be right let's see if they push that out pistons are gonna be right here So that should work. I'm just going to do this here real quick. So I can check it from the outside. That's not going to be the final place. Okay, so it almost worked. This. And this is what happens a lot of times with most of mine. This thing extends. This one extends before these extend. Or, um, no, uh, one of these didn't extend. What the heck? All right, let me, let me figure this out here. All right, so if I press that, it, it all goes back just fine. Press that again, nothing. Okay. So this... Wait, what? Why did that one work? Did you see that? That worked. What the heck? Yeah, so like if I cover that up. But I don't I don't think that's right. I don't think that's gonna happen every time. Yeah, see this? It screwed that one up. But sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Ooh, nice. My there we go. Ran out of juice. Hmm. So I don't want this to extend until it gets over to here. So what's making it extend early? Let's check and figure this out. What is making this thing extend early? Ah, we go charges in a second. Uh, I'm gonna go it in a second. I'm gonna go charge this and be right back. All right, so I am back. I'm going to take off this and this. See if that helps any. It might. It might not. We're gonna check. Boom. Nope. Still the same problem. That's extending too quickly. What's making it extend like that? Oops. Didn't mean to go in there. That's okay, I can do that. Alright, let's try this again. Bring that back. Now this thing is extending somehow. I know it's not any of these blocks. Hmm. Hmm. Let's maybe make the delay on here as long as it can go. Still just not pushing that out quick enough. But it brings it back in. Hmm. Hmm. What if I do this right here and bring it up and over? What if I did that? Yeah. 
you yoink. It still does not give me the right thing. Hmm. This is dumb. Alright, well let me figure this out here real quick and then I'll be back. Well, I think I might have figured it out. So if I, I'm going to place these blocks in here again. Boom, boom, boom. Put one right there. And I'm going to press the lever. Boom. Nice. So it actually works. And I'll show you what I'll show you what the issue was. Well, I don't exactly know what the issue was, but basically this block was getting powered before it could be pushed out. So, so the whole idea of this wall is that these pistons here push this out. They push this these two things out. So it pushes this block of walls and this block these two blocks of pistons out and then what happens is these pistons get powered and so then they push these blocks into this space if this goes first this block won't push so if power comes to this and this extends out this block isn't gonna push and this block won't either so pistons can't push extended pistons so that's why you need this delay as well. They also can't pull back extended pistons. So actually that's what the delay is for right here. The delay is so that when I shut off the thing, these pistons on this side are going to retract before these try pulling them back so that they can actually do that. So then it, when I hit this, boom, the wall is flush. If I hit it, if I hit it again, it's open. So that's pretty sweet. I'm going to kind of fill this up and then make sure that it's still working right. Because sometimes when you're replacing blocks, all right, guys, I figured this stuff out. Ugh, it was stupid. It took forever. So now I press that, flush. Press that, open. Okay, well, I mean, I guess it didn't take that long, and it's probably really messy, and I'm sure there's a better way to do it, but what I did was I basically took this, and there was, so if I put this on here, it's going to power this block as well, and that's a problem, because then that piston underneath it is extending. So I'm putting it here, and so then it powers this block, but the problem then is it doesn't power the bottom block at all. So what I did with that is I took this, and I ran the wire down and underneath basically the exact same thing that I did here, except underneath. So that's all. So what I'm going to do here, so I'm going to take this wireless receiver... I'm going to put it right there. We'll change it to 10. Might as well, right? And that's going to be our switch. Or that's going to be the thing that turns this on. Because I don't want to have that there. I want to have it a little more... A, li a little more secretive. At least a little more interesting. Definitely. So I'm going to close this up. Cool. Sweet. So now, I don't think I have my, do, 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 do. I don't think I have my remote. So I'm going to get that and maybe a few other supplies, and then we'll come back and finish this door. Oh my, so I totally forgot about my RS latch. But you guys made me forget about it. How dare you let me forget about it. Okay, yeah, maybe you didn't, but anyways. All right, so I'm going to pick this up. I'm going to pick this up, there we go, and I'm going to go into the wall, wireless receiver, throw that down again, we're going to put that at 10, then I'm going to put this latch here, and I think I need to change this around, yeah I do, so I'm going to change that, we're going to go in one more at least. See, I put a torch there. 
Okay, yeah, so that way I'll have, I'll go even one more, because I'm a G like that. All right, and then this is going to go right here. That'll go right there. So basically what this latch is doing is this right here, on, off, on, off, which actually I need to switch that around. Get back down there. All right. No. Nope. Yep. All right. So now every time I trigger this, on frequency ten, my wireless, boom. Nothing's gonna happen. So it's that stupid. I guess whatever. So the input is here. The output is here. I I don't exactly know why that is. I mean, I'd like for it to just go straight this way. Maybe it, there is a way to do that, but I couldn't figure it out. So if I go here, pulse 10, boom. And this stays on. If I pulse 10 again, it shuts off. So that's cool with this type of door because, mm, just throw this in here. Ooh, there we go. Because I can go ahead and pulse this, boom, and it's there and it'll stay there. So then I walk past and it looks like any old room, pulse it again, and all of a sudden I have Da, 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 my equivalent exchange room. Cool. Boom. So, one of the things I want to do here, I'm going to leave that out. And I didn't need to do all of that, I don't think. I'm going to put some bookshelves in here. Made a few of those. We can go four. I think I can do four right here too if I didn't screw that up which I did so I gotta put it back okay light this up a little I don't think I lit up down here did I can I there we go don't want no don't want no monsters spawning up in this room why is this so dark right here all of a sudden Oh, because I had something there. I'll put something right there. Okay. So we're going to put another bookshelf so this looks a little more incognito. So now, boom. Yoink! I got me a moving bookshelf. It's kind of cool. That looks sweet this way, too. Awesome. Now, to do some decorating. Now, I, I figured I'd just go ahead and go through and show you guys what I do as far as decorating and how I f find out like what I like and accept and and so on um so I'm gonna take this here and I think I'm gonna use I'm gonna use wood so I'm gonna go wooden slabs so I'm gonna turn that into a wooden panel and then I'm gonna turn that into a wooden panel strip I'm going to need some more of those. We'll go with 12. Go ahead and take that out. Alright, I've got my panel strips. Okay, cool. So now I can take these, which this actually might be... These might be a little too bulky, but we'll see. Maybe not. I'm just taking them and throwing them around the outside. So it doesn't look like it's flush with the wall. Because right now, as it is, when these are flush, it looks kind of dumb. If there's nothing kind of separating it. I don't know. I'm going to try... Let me try one more, th one other thing here. Mm, that's why I have an axe. Alright. 
let me I'm going to take that and split it up one more time I'll go with four oh just joking I have to put it back together into a panel cut it into strip covers and then those covers will turn into strips okay so let me figure out which one I like better here I wish these connected right here, but they don't. Hmm. I don't know. Which one do you guys like better? Let me know. Let me know which one you like. You could also do something like this, too. Go like that. I don't know. So I could do something like that, or like that or just keep it all one way. What do you guys think looks better? I don't know. Let me know. So I can take this, pulse that bad boy on frequency 10, not 11. Boom! I can walk in my room. Oh yeah. Pulse it again and nobody can get in. Hopefully this uh my uh, wireless redstone transmitter won't break. But I like that because then there's no buttons, there's nothing. It's just kind of this cool thing. Let me know what you think about those. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. I wonder if it would even look cool with these instead of the wood ones. Just let me just let me just give it a little, little gander here. Go ahead and take these off. All right. Throw these on. Hmm. That doesn't look too bad. You can even double it up. I think that might look stupid. Yeah, that looks kind of dumb. Mm-hmm. Dumb city. Alright, so I'm gonna take that off. Alright, cool. Yeah, so let me know. Which one do you like best? Which one do you think looks better? I think I might be leaning towards this one right here. Looks a little more normal. Or maybe the smaller ones with this brown texture. That's kind of cool, too. I don't know. I don't know. Alright, so we're going to make one other thing here today. We're going to make it fairly quick. Otherwise the episode will get very, very long, which I think it's already pretty long. But, whatever. What do you guys think? Do you, do you guys like long episodes? Do you like them shorter? What do you like? What do you want me to do? It's it's hard to know what what everyone wants, and it's hard to even let everyone get what everyone wants. Let everyone get what they want. There we go. Because uh, I mean, you can't you can't please everybody. Some people are going to be un unhappy and not want to watch anymore. Other people are going to love it and watch more. It's just the nature of the beast. All right. So I need to make a. Dun, 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 dun. Recycler. We like recycling, right? I recycle. Glowstone dust. A compressor. Uh, okay. Electronic circuit. Machine block. So I'm going to make a few compressors and then I'll be back. Actually, I'll just do it right here. Why not? Why the heck not? Alright. There we go. Grab my refined iron. Head on in this direction. I need some glowstone. I have glowstone in my bag. Right? Yep. Cool. Dirt. I don't have any dirt. Arrgh! Frustration. I should probably look at all of the, like, the whole recipe and figure that out before I start doing stuff. Uh, yeah, I need redstone. A bunch of other crap. 
All right, I think two should be, actually three will be perfect. It's the perfect number. It is not the loneliest number. Okay, and then one, two, three. All right, redstone, this stuff. We've got our electronic circuits, so that goes there. Smooth stone and that block, okay. Got some smooth stone. We got a lot of smooth stone in here, so I'll just take that. Thank you very much. Carry on. Hope your day is better than somebody else's. Yeah. All right, three compressors. All right, now I need to make this recycler compressor, two refined iron, dirt, and glowstone. So that means one, two, three, four, six refined iron. I only have four, so I guess we'll make two for now. And dirt. Ah, okay this a little bit backwards. Is that right? Yep. Nice. So I got two recyclers and once I get another refined iron ingot ignot then I will make one more of those. But for now that's what I got. I'm going to probably put them right uh, man where am I going to put these? Good question. I might put them back here. I might make this actually into a walkway because I need to get some power to them. I also need to get what is in them out. Yeah, that kind of makes sense. So maybe I'll put them there. I'll figure out exactly where I want to put them in the future. But for now, that's where they're going. They're just going to chill there till I see fit to move them. That's right. I'm the boss. Sun's coming up. I worked all the way through the night. Look at that. Terrible, terrible habit to, to develop. Alright. With that, I will bid you guys farewell. And now for your Minecraft haiku. Diamond underground. There it lies underfoot. I meet the hot lava. Thank you.